Are you as proud of your business acumen uh, as you are of your musical achievements? I have to tell you the God's honest truth is I don't have a fucking clue half the time what I'm doing. Uh, the one thing I do have is a very good, clear, and strong connection to my gut. My gut happens to coincide with what the masses want. I seem to know what that is a little right before they know it. I'm not years ahead. I'm not years behind. Whenever I've trusted the instincts of other people, I lose. I discovered Van Halen. I knew this was going to be the biggest band in America at the time. I don't know why I knew that. I had no qualification. I'd never discussed. It's the first band, other than the band I was in. I said, this is the band that's going to happen. I, I knew I'd never created any cartoon shows. I knew nothing about it. But I knew that if I did a show called My Dad the Rock Star, from the point of view of a 12-year-old kid, I could sell that to Nickelodeon. It's been on four years in 200 countries around the world in any language you want to see. It's a big hit. I knew if our show was called Gene Simmons Family Jewels, people would watch it if I was myself, if I never hit any of it, because besides my stunning good looks, I'm fascinating. Mm. And to be, to be, I would be remiss in my fiduciary duty and full disclosure before the fact if I said any other thing, because humbleness would sort of dilute the truth. Right. I really am fascinating. Yeah, I'm you're, fascinated. You're, I'm, either, I'm fascinated sure. just sitting here. Yeah. They're going, either he's, what a prick, what an asshole, or that guy's really fascinating. And either way, they're not switching the channel. That's what fascinating is. Right. I am delusionally in love with myself. Mm. I know on one hand, I'm nowhere near as good looking as I think I am, but because I'm delusional about it, I'm fearless. I can talk without hemming and hawing. I can look at you and I can walk in. I'll walk in with Brad Pitt. I don't care who the guy is, much better looking than I am. I will fuck his girlfriend that night. It is that will, that strength that actually makes things happen. It's not whether or not you actually have the good, it starts with will. So in business, in, in social circles, in anything else, it's this kind of first you need people skills, language skills, and other than that, the will of a giant. Nice. Well, let me ask you this. With all the stuff that you have going on, with the fact that uh, you have all these businesses and that the fact that the KISS that Kiss has turned into more than just a band, it, it is... It always was something else. It was always... Well, it's not respectable and uh, credible, and I could never... Those are, those are ideas that losers, people with small minds and small visions have. It's all, it was always about the big picture. The reason we wore makeup and high heels and stuff like that was always about the, we're not just a band, there's something else going on here. We didn't know at the time, at the beginning, that it, uh, it was going to start on stage and would eventually lead to this. Nice. We're, we're partners with Visa, and uh, I mean, why can't we be a part of every facet of your life? Notice I'm holding it here long enough for the cameras to close yeah, in. Yeah, no, I, I got it. Because it's free, yeah. yeah. Uh, well, I just want to ask you, um, do you ever think that perhaps the KISS Visa card, the KISS coffin, and things like that may overshadow the music, or is the music just one component part of the KISS overall? Who cares? <laughs> Look, everybody's exactly in the same KISS business as KISS is in. We just do it a zillion times bigger. Everybody goes out on tour and sells T-shirts. You're in the KISS business, baby. See, it's, when you buy a T-shirt, you don't get music. You're in the licensing and merchandising business. The fact, the only thing everybody's complaining about, REM and Thing and punk bands and thrash bands, although there are no more of those... Whatever you want, a death metal band, eh, we're not like Kiss. Yes, you are. You're goddamn straight you are. Johnny Rodden, Johnny Lydon, who has always been straight up about it. Yeah, I know. He's very honest. Very honest. This sucks. You better pay me money, and that's life. We're all exactly the fuck the same. And anybody that tells you that they want less money in life, be suspicious of this person. This is a liar. Everybody wants more money. I just want enough money to get... You're full of shit. It's never enough. You know when, you're, when it's enough? When you're dead. That's when it's enough. <laughs> um, what is your involvement in the music industry at this point? I support new bands, um, but there's no more record industry. I went on record initially uh, when Kazaa 